Hello, so I wanted to make a video today for the Squishy community. Why did I just say Squishy? I used to collect Squishies. The Squishmallow community. Um, you guys all love collecting Squishmallows. You love how squishy they are, how cute they are, how they kind of go in a set, all that stuff. I wanted to take the Squishmallow community and introduce you guys to the Pokemon community in a way that you can collect adorable Pokemon stuff that might be nostalgic to you, but also be amazing and soft and squishy like your Squishmallow collections. So let me dive into specific Pokemon toys that I have found that are just like Squishmallows. Gordon, this one's not about you. Come on, we love you, but you gotta move for a little bit. Now I want to start this out with something you may not expect it. So, this is a regular size Poké doll. The Poké dolls in particular are so fun, so collectible. They kind of take all your favorite Pokémon and make them into this cute little chibi size, which I love so much. Um, these in particular aren't squishy or anything. They are fully stuffed, stuffed animals, but they are made of minky and they're very soft, just like your Squishimals. Now what I want to, sh to show you though is the miniature Pokey dolls. So this is a miniature Poplio Pokey doll. See, it's still a Pokey doll, but it is the keychain version. Now, something very interesting about the keychain version of a lot of Pokey dolls that I've noticed is, oh my gosh, they're squishy like Squishmallows. They have that kind of marshmallow feel. And the second I met this little man. He was sitting right next to the adult size Poké doll, the full size Poké doll, but I had to get him for how squishy he was. So I got him in Japan. Um, this squishy thing started in Japan, actually. Um, a lot, I have a lot of products from Japan that are just no name brand, but they're like super squishy and super soft. So I really wanted to show you guys that if you collect the tiny miniature Poké dolls, which, look how cute. But these guys in particular could be of the squishy variety. And if you just collect a ton of these, just think of how cute so many little guys would be. All squishy and all just so cute and collectible. Next up, I need to show you like my favorite part of my collection. And that is my Jumbo Mochiri Drifloom. So they make these still at the Pokemon Center. Um, you can get them online at the Pokemon Center online. Um, Drifloom's not available anymore. He was in the first wave. Um, I got him in Japan and he is amazing, but they have like an Oddish, they have a Ditto, and honestly, I'm sure they'll come out with more. Now, I want to show you the size. One, he's soft. He's Squishmallow, but the quality, amazing. The size, this is the giant Gordo. Look how big this boy is. Oh, I said Gordo, I mean Gordon. <laughs> he's so squished up because I have him on my couch, but look how big this plush is. And it's just as squishy and just as nice and one of my favorite Pokemon ever. So the last group of squishy Pokemon that I want to show you is the Hello Ponyta line. So this one came out in Japan with so much merchandise. Like they had um, like little notepads, they had stickers, they had notebooks. Oh God, I mean they had keychains, they had everything. But at least in the American Pokemon store online, we got the plush and the plush keychains, which are about maybe twice the size as this guy, but just as squishy. Now, these this line was made by a specific artist with Hello Ponyta and friends. Um, the tags aren't very interesting, but they do show his art. So look at that Ponyta art. And here is the Galarian Ponyta art. But these guys are the squishiest most adorable plush ever oh my gosh like you guys know what i mean if you have squishmallows you know what squishy is and these guys are it it is such a cute kind of my little pony-ish version of ponita i mean it takes like an adorable spin on the original pokemon and it's just so squishy and soft and then of course the galarian was always the my little pony of the bunch but she too is just as squishy, just as soft, and just as adorable. So with this line, they didn't just make the Ponitas, even though that's what I personally got. They actually had a few of the friends. I have the, um, that includes the ice cream. Uh, 
It includes the Ice Cube Penguin Escusi and I think um, Hatterene. It, what's the little one called? Um, the little baby one. It includes uh, squishy versions of those. And you can also get the ponies in um, a keychain size so you get an extra small squishy to bring on your bags. So I really wanted to introduce you to these guys and tell you that these are also so cool to collect. And since these plush from this artist were well received in Japan, I wouldn't put it past him for making more or making another cute line of this kind of mochi styled stuffed animal. So now that we're at the end of my squishy or um, plush of Pokemon, I would say that the easiest one to collect for anyone that's just trying to get into it would definitely be the miniature Poke dolls or the Mochiri collection plush because these are available online and you can kind of tell by the style of it or you can read reviews to see if it's a squishy one or if it's a bit harder and not in like like a normal stuffed animal and not like our squishmallows which we love so much but i would say collecting these is adorable you can put them on all your things you can have them hanging i used to have this guy hanging off my computer but since i moved like he's moved off and now he's in the pokemon closet with all my pokemon plush but I hope you enjoyed this and I hope you find some cool other squishy things to collect if you're so into that. They are so cuddly, so wonderful to have on your bed, which I have Drifloom a lot on my bed. And we all know how much we love to uh, squish and collect cute things. So I hope you found this enjoyable. I hope you find your own Pokemon stuff to collect and I'll see you again soon. Bye! You can find me as X online on Instagram and as Fairy on Twitch. And you're already on my channel, so you can find me here if you like, subscribe. Um, thank you so much for always being here with me and checking out what we have going on. And keep loving Pokemon. Keep collecting.